WTFNN. Headline news update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 1 p.m. Eastern time on Thursday, three hours left to go in the trading day. We got markets hanging around in negative territory right now. S&P negative by one point, trading at 3110. You get the Dow Jones negative by 40 points, trading at 27,608. NASDAQ negative by 10, trading at 8555. Oil contract backing off a bit off 19 pennies at 5823. Quite a day in oil yesterday, almost $2 to the upside. Oil almost made it to $59 today before backing off a bit. Notes and bonds, we got a little bit of lower price and higher yield. The 10-year off four ticks, 129.09. The 30-year off 11 ticks at 158.12. And the dollar index continuing some weakness. The dollar index off 265 ticks at 97.383. We'll start things off. Let's jump over to a few of the charts. We'll start it off with the Dow 30. Coming into the opening bell this morning, I say the opening bell, 6.30 a.m. We were up there at 27,766. You can see the sell-off that begins right at 9.30. We go from 27,731. We make a low, as we did in all the indices, just after 10 a.m. of 27,559. So you're talking about almost 200 Dow points from high to low there, currently trading 27,603. S&P 500, we were up there early this morning at 31.24. For context here, the high that we had early, early uh, Monday, excuse me, was 31.58. So we're still off of that high by about 48 S&P points right now. We dive lower to almost 3,000. We make, excuse me, almost 3,100. We make it to 3,103, currently trading 3,109. Jumping over to the crude oil chart, as I mentioned, above $59 briefly, just after the opening bell, Currently trading at 58.35 for a little context as I referenced. How about the run yesterday in crude? You back things up to early, early. Tuesday morning, 55 handle even. That's Tuesday. Yesterday, we're down there at a 56.30. We run all the way up to $59. Currently trading at $58.36. What else we have happening in the market? We got weekly jobless claims this morning. That number, a seven-month low. Initial jobless claims, 203,000. For the week ended November 30th, should be interesting to see how that plays into non-farm payrolls tomorrow morning, 8.30 a.m. Basil Chapman, he will be live on the air for them, folks. Tomorrow morning at 8.30 a.m., we get that non-farm payroll jobs number. The market awaits that number for sure. Stay tuned, folks. we got a man, Steve Rhodes, coming up live right now. Dave White, live at 2 o'clock. Tom O'Brien, live at 3. We'll be right back.